Everyone's been talking about it. Patty Pimblett's decision victory over Jared Gordon at UFC 282. Do fighters have the same scorecard? I asked them in the latest edition of MMA Pros React. I thought Patty lost. I thought he lost. Um, I thought he lost every round. Yeah, man. I think if you're being very forgiving, you can give him a round. You can give him every round too. Like I think uh, if, if I had to give him, if I had to be very open with it, I can, you, you can give him. I can see a case for round two. Like okay, but there's no way he. I don't think he won that fight. I think he was down two rounds to one. And my God, to give him three rounds is absolutely criminal. And like that judge needs to be held accountable because I know mistakes happen, but that's two glaring mistakes, two days in a row, back to back. And you're costing people money. You're like that. Luckily with stocks, it didn't really matter, but like they screwed Jared Gordon. I thought Jared won 100%. I think he was landing the cleaner shots. Pretty much backed him up the whole time. And third round, he cruised a little bit, but it doesn't matter. He had the dub, he won the first two rounds with ease. And then the third round was dominated by him either. So the deal, like I said, three rounds to none. Should have should have easily went to Jared. Yeah, I thought I thought Gordon won that pretty clearly, <laughs> you know? And people are like, oh, the UFC wanted Patty to win. It's like, no, the UFC does not control the decisions, clearly. Like, there's been a lot of decisions the UFC was not fucking happy with, you know? But um, the UFC didn't decide that. Is But the so I wish the judges would have to explain why. Don't even get me started. I, I you know, I'm not going to talk smack about Patty because Patty brings eyes to the sport that I love doing. So, um, you know, but, you know, finish fights. That's all I got to say. Finish the fights and you can't, then you don't have to worry about anything. So um, that's on him, Patty. Uh, you know, Patty's Patty. He's going to go out there. Next fight, people are going to forget about this fight. They're going to forget how close it was. And then he's going to come out in his next fight. And the same amount of people times 10 are going to be watching him no matter what. So he's doing the right thing. The UFC is doing the right thing by pushing him because he gets so many views on everything. Um, he's doing good. But uh, it was a close. It was, it was, yeah, I don't know. Man, I, I mean, I, I think he lost. I mean, uh, like, I mean, especially me being a ground guy, but like, with my ground, that's why I always go to finish, you know? That's why I have the record on the Tuesday night contender for the most submission attempts ever, it's because I go to finish, and it doesn't matter if it's the first, second, or third. And in my career, I've finished fights in every round. So uh, I've even fought championship rounds. I didn't finish in the championship rounds, but that's the only fight that I went to a decision. So like, I've done it all, man. I've had the experience. I've been in the sport over a decade. Uh, I think the layoff worked out worked out great for me to go lay out for two years realize what i really want how bad i want this everything i worked for to get there to just give it up i never thought i'd do that so for the opportunity to come back i don't regret nothing i'm glad i made every decision i made because if i wouldn't have i wouldn't be here today wouldn't be getting ready to come back january 14th i mean there's two things like patty pimlet imagine patty pimlet's from america you know what i mean like patty pimlet's from america no one gives a shit about patty pimlet like the fact that he's from the UK, like those guys have like the religious following, like they love their athletes and it's the complete opposite in America. Like we don't give a shit about our athletes. We actually like root for <laughs> the guy from the UK. Um, you know, so I think, you know, Patty Clement was given the craziest Christmas gift I've ever seen in my life. Like, you know, Santa fucking just shined on him that night. Uh, that's one of the worst decisions that MMA I've ever seen. You know what I mean? Like, but it was funny because I was, I was doing an interview with the MMA, you know, doing like a, a live stream with the MMA junkie guys. And we were like, we were joking. We were like, so we think Jared Gordon won all three rounds, but you know, Patty Pimlet was going to win. And that was like a joke. We were all laughing about it. And then he did. And then we were all just like, what the fuck just happened? Like, how does that happen? You know, and then for Patty Pimlet to be so confident and like, yeah, you know, I, well, I knew I won the first two rounds. I'm like, you, you knew you won? Dude, you were getting <laughs> smacked up in that fight. Every time you came in, you got smoked with the left hook. Like, how can you say that? You know what I mean? Like, you you don't believe that. Like, you were getting cracked. And the only reason, you know what I mean? Like, that that a judge could even see it as, as relatively close is because you didn't go down. You know what I mean? Like, 
like obviously you got a you got a chin kid like you're pretty tough like in the pocket but you, you got your ass whooped you know I, I if i was jared gordon i would i don't even know what i would do i would lose my fucking mind you know what i mean because i've been on the wrong side of, of, of those decisions and you just you're, you're like dude what, what do i need to do to win a fight you know what i mean like how do you hold somebody on the cage for four minutes and like that guy wins that round like that's just that's absurd to me like all right so we're, we're judging like everything on, on on damage but like you do know like that when you're pressed up your shoulders against the cage and you're throwing strikes it's pretty much like your cat smacking you in the face like you're not <laughs> yeah it's it's that's embarrassing to call any of that damage yeah i mean that that one that one just puzzled me Head kicks with the pros picks up the fights or anything in the mix getting closer to the heart of the flame bringing conversations with heavy hitting names you feel the love of the game you want to talk about odds